very beautiful. Police used to say that to me. <laughs> you know, for someone who just fell down a mine shaft, you look incredible. Well, you look pretty good yourself. Goes with being a superhero. The way you took care of me last night. Building a fire and using your body heat to keep me from freezing. Is it my imagination or do Fancy and Luis look like a couple in love? The look on Sheridan's face. Ah, so it's not my imagination. So, how's my patient today? Ah, much better, Dr. Russell. Eve. Hey, right, Sheridan. I didn't see you there when I came in. Fancy sure does look good, thanks to Luis. I can't even count how many times Luis saved my life. Two women in love with the same man is never a good thing. But when the women are an aunt and her niece and cranes to boot, well, this could get ugly. These flowers are so beautiful, Luis. You really shouldn't have. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> well, yeah. I want the biggest bouquet of flowers that you can put together. Uh. Yeah, I don't know what kind of flowers. Uh, something cheerful, okay? It's for someone in the hospital. No, I'll deliver it myself. Everyone down at the station chipped in for them. They want you to get back to work as soon as you can. I didn't realize I was so popular. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Fancy, everyone's crazy about you. Everyone? Please? Well, uh, why don't I put these in some water? Please, oh I can't thank you enough for saving my life. The way you kept me warm with your body heat and all the sweet things you whispered to me, keeping my hopes up and encouraging me to hold on. And it worked. Hey, you are a true hero. Hmm. My hero. Well, I really should be going. Well, Luis and I understand. Thank you so much for stopping by. Hey, yeah. Hey, my niece. I love you. I love you, too. Actually, Luis, would you mind stepping out while I finish Nancy's examination? No, I don't mind if Luis stays. He's seen me naked before. Hmm. Well, if you're going to be my patient, then you're going to have to do things my way. <coughs> so come on, everybody out. Dr. Russell, is she going to be okay? It's just a routine examination. Yeah. Well, I'll be waiting for you, Luis. Well? Amazing to say. You don't seem any worse for the wear. Oh. <laughs> well, it's because of Luis. You should have seen him, Dr. Russell. When the platform I was on gave way, he dived into the shaft to save me without thinking twice. Well, you know, that sounds like Luis's heroics. He's local harmony lore. Especially as it concerns Sheridan. Oh? Well, yeah, he saved her 
countless times. And then in the end, he broke her heart. I think if you're not careful, you could end up just like her. I thought you liked Luis. I do. And why would you say he'll end up breaking my heart? It's not Luis so much as it's, it's the situation. But obviously, you care for Luis, and he cares for you. Yeah. And then, there's Sheridan, your aunt. She loves Luis, and he still loves her. Even though she's gone on with Chris, and even though he's trying to go on with you. The thing is, honey, whenever there's three people romantically involved, somebody is bound to get hurt. What am I supposed to do? Let Aunt Sheridan have Louise back? No way. No. I just thought I should warn you. Just be careful of your heart. Situations like these, they can lead to more pain than you can imagine. I appreciate your concern. But Aunt Sheridan has made a decision to stay with Chris. And Luis is free to be with me. And I want him. And I think he wants me, too. I, not my Aunt Sheridan. I don't know how to explain this, but... I guess I ought to try. Your Aunt Sheridan. She's a beautiful person. And you, you are a beautiful person. Both of you. Just lovely, inside and out. Thanks, Dr. Russell. But... You take my word for this. There is something in the crane gene pool, something that keeps a crane from letting anyone they love leave them. Sheridan may say that she's finished with Luis, but if she's not, well, she could do some things that you might not expect of her. Like what? Oh, see, that's just the point. When a crane is involved in a love triangle, there's just, there's just hell to pay. Like your father, and me, and T.C., and now you, and Luis, and Sheridan. I just don't want any of you to be hurt because you were following your hearts. Well, there won't be a problem, Dr. Russell. Even if Aunt Sheridan still has feelings for Luis, she said she moved on. Plus, she saw how Luis has moved on to me. So I'm not worried about her causing problems. Not in the least. <laughs>